Uh, good morning, everyone. Uh, my name is Carl Mueller. I'm here uh, pinch hitting for Brad Hayes. He's uh, trapped in some air travel, so I have the pleasure of uh, speaking for him. Uh, I'm one of his senior PhD students. Uh, uh, in his lab, uh, we call ourselves Cairo, which stands for the Collaborative Artificial Intelligence and Robotics Laboratory. Um, our labs focuses on developing algorithms and systems uh, that we test and validate in the setting of uh, human-robot interaction or human-robot collaboration. Um, I can speak to some of uh, the research themes that we focus on in our lab. Uh, Myself, I focus on learning from demonstration. Uh, learning from demonstration is a set of techniques where you try to teach a robot some sort of task, uh, either by imitation, teleoperation, kinesthetic demonstration, uh, in lieu of exactly programming the robot to do, uh, to do a skill. Um, another one of my colleagues focuses on explainable AI and intelligent tutoring. Uh, his name is Akib uh, Tabrez, and his research focuses on developing human models of a shared collaborative task. And the idea is that the robot will try to predict what policy or how the human is conducting the skill in order to either correct the behavior or provide instruction on how to best carry out the behavior. Um, another colleague of mine, Jeff Phoenix, is focusing on uh, lifelong learning here uh, using this robot here, which is a Canova Movo. Uh, the idea behind his research is to draw upon continuous learning of previous experiences to continuously update models uh, to inform new and novel interactions that the robot hasn't come across before. Um, so as many of you know in this room, uh, Tom, Automation is expensive and flexible, time-consuming, and uh, often difficult to implement safely. Um, but through the approaches in our lab, we believe that we're going to enable uh, smaller and more social robots to inject themselves into small and medium-sized businesses to revolutionize manufacturing. Uh, so my own research and uh, learning from demonstration will enable experts to train robots without programming and provide certain assurances of safety. Uh, the uh, lifelong learning research uh, uh, will continuously self-direct and enhance teamwork uh, in human-robot uh, settings. Um, human behavior recognition and prediction is important for you know, just-in-time assistance or if you need a robot to help you with a task where you aren't able to communicate a need, it might be able to predict you know, a tool that you need for a certain task. Um, and explainable AI, which is a pretty broad topic, but in you know, the focus of our lab, you know, the idea is to verify model accuracy and the learning of these superhuman level systems. Um, so as a newer lab, we're always looking for uh, new corporate and academic uh, collaborations. And uh, if you'd like to speak to me about that, um, I'll see you in the next break. So thank you very much.